Hundreds of classes with thousands of students equals a major organizational headache for teachers and administrators. That's why we've added Google Classroom integration to explain everything. Now you can seamlessly share information between Google Classroom and explain everything, and getting classes and individual students signed up is easier than ever. Let's check out how to integrate your students with Google Classroom and explain everything. First, make sure that you have Google Classroom organized with your students and groups. Then, go to Discover, log into your account, and go to your profile. Scroll down to the Invite Users tab where you will find Google Classroom. Tap it to start the user invite process. On the next screen, you'll see Import Type at the top. This will automatically be set to Append. You can see all of your classes and the individual students as well. From there, you can select individual students or whole classes to invite to explain everything. If a student has already logged in to explain everything with their email address, they will be grayed out from the list. Want to completely wipe your list of current invites and accounts? Simply change the import type from append to replace. This allows you to create a brand new list of students while eliminating the older invitations and accounts completely. This is a great way to quickly invite new classes of students at the start of a new semester. After appending or replacing, you'll be taken back to your account where you can see your list of imported students. Then, all your students have to do to activate their accounts is use Google to sign into the app. If you change your mind or you imported the wrong email list, you can easily remove a single student or all of them at once. Sometimes you have to make changes to the list. Maybe you granted your student an account, but then, due to the number of licenses, you decided to remove that user from your group. If you later decide to invite that student again, his or her account will be automatically converted to an active one without you or your student doing anything. Just remember, it won't happen if you already gave all of your licenses away and they are active.